Oh, there she go. I'm out here at Six Line Trail again. Uh, this is from the Guelph Line exit, past the Mohawk Racetrack. Uh, gonna try to get Amanda Flats or Eclipse again. Cliffless, technically, but uh, so I'm just gonna get back into that, get comfortable. I'm gonna have to bail out there for a few minutes again, and then we'll see what happens. Don't know how challenging I'm gonna keep it today, but I keep it as good as possible. I'm not going to go down the hydro section here, I'll go somewhere else. Go down this section here. Oh, there's a little red squirrel. Yeah, let's go here though. I mean, I just did a big ride two, two days in a row. But still feel pretty good today. Beautiful fall day. Oh, it's supposed to rain tomorrow. Hence why I'm trying to do this. I'll try one of that rock wall. Up here. Oh. Almost gonna hide the bail there, so cut my foot out quick. I feel like I'm gonna fall over today a few times. Hopefully this will help with the level of commitment. That's what they say with the... There we go. Got through it. It is nice having the uh, power up and down on the stroke. We tire these for another season. I thought that was, but close. I put just a less air than my shock too. I think it's making it a little more comfortable for sure.
And you mostly just stop thinking about it. Has been even clipped in. And then I start thinking about having my feet where I want them at all times. Maybe that might help. Hopefully it's still getting a good video, I think it's a fall day. I don't know how much I'll put into the struggles. Good boy. I see a house. Even nothing really good of me and I still... Okay, let's see when you over these logs. Oh yeah, there we go. Beautiful day. There she go. I'm running like a champ. Good boy. I also people uh I was on one forum and they weren't very happy with Eagle. Uh I asked the question, any off-leash trail parks for mountain biking? As uh he's really good and you can see he sticks right with me and doesn't run off and cause issues with wildlife for people so uh, a person commented that they got chased down by a, a off-leash dog and hurt themselves and that really sucks it really does and if there's people with their dogs off-leash on trails that aren't that's not cool um, these trails are recognized as having you have to you can have your dog on leash or in control as you see Hugo he sticks by my side he's in control He'd rather, the only thing he wants to do is run beside his, his buddy. I've met, someone mentioned to me that a good way to tell is, oh, I just threw over a snake. Oops, poor snake. I hope, I hope he's okay. A good way to tell if it's off leash or not. They also let horses on it. They let horses on it, they're also off leash, which just kind of makes sense. So, uh, yeah. So I did, uh, so uh, someone was kind enough to Help me find a spot. Another person, uh, this was kind enough to kind of scold me, but once again, you gotta be responsible 
you gotta be considerate of others. Let's stop and enjoy the scenery for a little bit sometimes. Yeah, stop and enjoy the scenery, right Hugo? Yeah. Alright, stop for a bit of a drink. Probably enjoy the, few, the last few days. I mean, this week is going to be cold. They said that's going to be raining tomorrow and like seven high, like seven or eight degrees Celsius, uh, which I, I don't much sure what that is in Fahrenheit. I guess you can just use Google, figure that out. So, uh, trying to get out with Hugo as much as I can while the weather's nice. I am planning on riding through the winter as much as I can. Uh, I tried last year with my old bike. My tires weren't set up for it. Oh yeah, I remember this section. This is a tough section. Yeah, I'm not climbing up that. I was scared of thinking about going that will allow it, but I'm just going to continue on this. Try to get Hugo some distance. He enjoys that rather than worrying so much about scenery or trail challenging sections. It looks like they had in this section uh, some, uh, was a pine beetle? Hit some trees this year, it looks like. Kind of stinks, but now we got some, hopefully, some compost as the stuff starts to go. Let's go down here. Good boy, Hugo. Left here. I did a trail run with a bunch of guys yesterday. You know, in this section, we tried to get as many people as possible. Uh, different varying skill levels and groups. Trying to promote getting out, exercise. Uh, some people just go to the gym. Some people don't do anything. So um, it's good to be out for that fresh air and uh, enjoy the scenery. Hopefully, this is a good view. I think I'm going to stop now and just quickly check to make sure my camera angle is good. I think we can go up left here. If I'm not correctly this Nisi. I'm gonna hit the main loop and then head all the way back. So I'm not too sure how long this video will last. But as always, for the well only a few subscribers right now, but Hopefully one day, maybe a little bit more. I always enjoy coming on the ride. I know myself, I like to live vicariously through other people. Sometimes what they can do or... I don't know. What privileges they have to go to cool places and... Cool trail rides that I might otherwise never be able to go or... I don't have the time to. Uh, sometimes it's almost just as peaceful. Well, not obviously just as peaceful, but more peaceful than watching people striving after just material things. Having the ability to be out and get some fresh air and enjoy the simple things.
here you go right behind me puffing and puffing Whew. That was the spot yesterday I came up on a trail I hadn't run in a long time. You can see it's absolutely just gorgeous. They come up this forest to like meadow of pines and it's just like I don't know, very peaceful and serene. The trail here is amazing. Okay, excuse me, still recording. So this next time we go down, super fun. There's actually a bit of a loop. Tavian, next time he comes with me, wants to head down this. So, Tavian, little sections for you. I'm gonna try doing this loop once and see what happens. Very fast, so we'll see how he go. There's. There you go. Look at this, how beautiful this is. It's just phenomenal. It's a little bit tight through there, but nothing can handle. Bad line. Last time I think I went wide on this. That's what I gotta do next time. Okay, well, it's kind of like a bad version of it, but anyways, let's get the rest of that. I think it's the only challenging part, really. And last time I had no problem getting up that, just probably wasn't looking far enough ahead or wasn't thinking well enough. There I go, clubbed in. Pretty good line. Yeah. There we go. Oh, it's nice. I need a few drink. Hugo, come here. Time's at 
and it comes out here and this is the other section the start of it looks like here you go come here come here come on let's go come get a drink hey here you go holy moly this is quite the uh i've never even seen this obstacle yet i'm gonna go around it just because Oh, I'm a little bit of a scary cat with clips on today, and I don't know if I'm getting hurt, but I could do that with flats, probably no problem. This other part of the loop, these little rock boulders, eh? Kind of remind me of like those boulder people from Frozen. Hey, eh? What do you think? All mossy covered, rolling around. There's a different line there. What that line is. Good boy, Hugo. Oh, this is that main loop. Okay. Hey boy. Good boy. Oh, good question. Where do we go? I guess we go left, yeah? All uh, right. No, I think the right goes... Actually, right goes where we were. Yeah, let's go right. Let's go right this way. I actually think I like the shock the way it's set up now. I definitely see flats being on good on slow slowly or flash slowly trails. I mean, clips, I mean, clips, whatever. Oh, but, uh, 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 woo! That was a bit of a challenge. Hell strikes, but. Oh, maybe I can't get used to it.
I'd love to try that out. Touch that with Fabian. It's not a low risk. Now you don't have to fall, don't fall off far. Good boy. I invite uh, if anyone's watching this from the online community. Community, I guess not community. <laughs> uh, BKXC, Chef Bike Hacks, any of the other places, any of those other guys, Skills of Phil, GMEN. Just come to this uh, forest, you can see it's super challenging, super fun, lots of little features. Okay, let's go, Hugo. Not to last you go. Yeah, good boy. Yep. Good boy. Good boy. There you go. That was a little bit uh, kind of rough.
so far we've done uh, what, 7k? 7k? 5 Evo 8, maybe 9k when we're done. I'm at 170k this year, trails. My goal is to hit 200. That's the goal. I think it's attainable. Two more rides, maybe three more rides. Realistically, temperature is not going to be a factor. I'm going to be working hard. I guess there'll be the ice initially, and then snow might make it more challenging. Oh, there's a nice little climb. I'm coming. Oof. Three days in a row biking. Maybe this is a little challenging. Here you go. He's had a day of rest in between. Had yesterday off. Took him on Sunday. So I've been three days in a row. Whew. Ah. Ah. ah, the best part of this is going downhill again. Ah, there you go, here you go. Some trees are going inside, I guess that's okay, but I figured to have this to protect something, so I'm just going to make use of that. Supposedly there's deer in this forest. People have seen it. I've only ever seen a porcupine. And squirrels and red squirrels and chipmunks. And dogs. Nice little downhill section. Let's see how far I can roll up.
Alright, here comes Hugo. There you are. Oh. Want a drink? Here you go. So Jack is a little crooked. He doesn't care. Still the only person here. Love it. <sighs> well, thanks for riding with me and Hugo, and uh, thanks for watching the video. And uh, be back again uh, this week and make another video. So. This time I'm going to ride my flat, so hopefully you can maybe do some sessioning on some of these features. So uh, enjoy the rest of your day and uh, have a good ride.